Hey, this is Zach from WhiteyMy.com, and today I'm going to show you guys how to add the Amplitude VST into Reaper. So first thing we're going to do is go to Options, and then we're going to go down to Preferences. You can also hit Control P. Once we're in Preferences, we're going to scroll down until we find Plugins, and then we're going to click VST. Right here where it says VST Plugin Pass, we're going to click Add. Once Browse for Folder is up, we're going to go to Computer, and then we're going to go to our C Drive. Once we're in our C drive, we're going to go to Program Files, and then we're going to find VST Plugins. So it's right here. Go ahead and click OK. So right here it should say C drive, Program Files, and then VST Plugins. If you could not find VST Plugins, you're going to have to find your Amplitude3.dll file on your own, and then use that folder instead. But it should be right here in VST Plugins. So go ahead and click Apply, and then OK. So we're going to close Reaper and open it back up so that I can load that VST. Once it's loaded back up, we're going to click track and then insert new track. Right now we're just making sure that it loaded just fine. So we're going to go to FX and we're going to search for Amplitude 3. And right there it is. It loaded it alright. So click OK. I'm just going to show you guys that it worked for me. So there it is. So this should work for you as long as you have that VST plugins file. If not, you're just going to have to find it on your own and do the same instructions I showed you in this video. So if this could help you, um, like this video and subscribe and check out the link in the description. It's going to have a written tutorial on how to do this and hope it worked for you guys.